Tisk, tisk, tisk. Will AMP ever, ever, ever reach $1? Look, if you're a real AMP investor and holder slash AMP nation king or queen, you're going to want to watch this one to the end and you know what I mean. Okay. All right. So this question was asked all the way back in June 16 when AMP was about nine. Okay. Look, it was about nine right there. Okay. But today it went all the way to this okay it's up a little bit because it was down lower like around four cent okay but now it's six all right but like i said in another video the video titled treat amp like it's a startup company go back and watch that video i strongly suggest if you're not an investor i mean not a subscriber see <laughs> look it just changes man all day all right so that video emphasizes why yeah, you shouldn't be staring at this daily chart all day. Okay. My mission is to get you guys to be real investors and, uh, and you know, investor minded and not focusing on these daily charts. Okay. The stock market then trained us and, and, and all of that to just be sitting here looking at charts. And so now we bring that over here to the cryptocurrency world and just stare at charts all day. And they can go up and down depending on hype, influencers, uh, celebrity tweets and all of that. Look, if you're a real investor, a smart investor, you're in it for the long term. You're not just focused off with some hype. OK. All right. So what we are asking is, will AMP ever reach a dollar? So our prediction that we've been going through as a nation, as an AMP nation, you've been watching. If you're a subscriber, we are uh, predicting that by 2022, it will be at least at a dollar. If these collaborations that Flex of Payments have coming up, which is, you know, AMP Nation, uh, if they go through, then it could be way more than a dollar. It could be at least about five, okay, by 2022. That's just a prediction. I don't have a crystal ball. I don't know uh, them personally, which is why I told you guys to start the petition, interview AMP. Put hashtag interview amp a gazillion times. Nah, not a gazillion times, but just put that in the comments so that we can start a petition. We can get the creators of the amp on here and we can see what's going on behind the scenes so that we can really start helping the mission, start pumping this mug. So will amp ever reach a dollar? Guess what? Some ways that's all up to you guys. These are called community tokens. Like when you go to all of their pages, they always call them a community token. You know what I'm saying? But let me tell you why it's going to reach a dollar. Okay. This is the amptoken.org site. If you're currently interested in investing into cryptocurrency to stay safe, never copy a contract address from a Twitter, a Reddit, uh, any social media or any un uncredited an unaccredited website, okay? Because they can drain your wallets and then you broke than more broke than you were before you wanted to invest, okay? So stay safe, all right? Real world application. And a lot of people like, David, who cares about real world application? Who cares about real world application? Remember the whole movement of cryptocurrency was to replace the US dollar, the risk was to replace government regulated currency, okay? So, you can't replace real world currency without real world application. It just don't make no sense when people try to argue with me. <laughs> Look, I'm not a crypto pro, but I know business. For instance, I'm an actual business owner and I keep watching. I'm going to show you expose. <laughs> You're going to discover all of those keywords. <laughs> You're going to see some of my actual local businesses. All right. So I know business. That's why I know this will work. OK, so any real world application. OK, so Amp provides assets uh, with instant verifiable assurance for any real world application like loans, loan distributions, digital payments, property sales and more. So it has a purpose, man. And it's a long term purpose. It can help with so much. So I strongly suggest you guys read the white paper for this. Make sure y'all stay to the end, man. And if you haven't did a Jet Lee side kick to the like button already or a Bruce Lee style spinning back kick without the Y to the subscription button, do that, man. Do that right now. Support Amp Nation. Push this out to the algorithm. Open up another browser and share it in like 50 Facebook groups. The world needs to know, man. Stop letting Bitcoin and Ethereum dominate all of the damn YouTube feeds. 
and Instagram feeds. Push these videos out for all the AMP creators, not just me, but it only takes you a second to do that. You can pause this video right now, open another browser and share it in all of your Facebook groups. Do that for me and then put a hashtag, I did it, David, and we'll see what I can give you in return, all right? But anyway, back to the mission, okay? So will AMP ever reach a dollar? Like I said, if they stay on the track that they're on right now, <laughs> by 2022, it will be far, <laughs> far past a dollar. I'm going to say that with confidence because, I mean, it's already talks with them doing things with gigantic companies. Their strength is the real world application, the real life usage. Okay, so we're going to go, we're going to see where is Flex of Payments accepted. We already know AMP is with Flex, all right? So retailers have piloted Flex uh, that have piloted Flex and include Barnes and Noble, Bed Bath and Beyond, Crate and Burrow, GameStop, Lowe's, Nordstrom, Office Depot, Office Max, and Petco. Also, this is why we know that eventually, look, Y'all got to be able to look deeper into stuff, man. All right. <laughs> Put a hashtag. Yeah, baby. All right. So uh, this is how we know Amazon will eventually have to. <clears throat> they will eventually have to accept cryptocurrencies, at least AMP or do something with Flex of Payments because Whole Foods is owned by Amazon, right? Yeah, baby. Put that in the comments. Whole food. No, no, no. Don't put that. Put yeah, baby, in the comments. I should see a million yeah, babies in the comments. Okay. <laughs> All right. So as y'all can see, Whole Foods, <laughs> that's owned by none other than Amazon. A smart decision by Jeff Bezos was he, when he was in there. Okay. So he ain't there no more, but they still own Whole Foods. Sheets is leveraging its existing NCR point of sale solution and payment gateway to accept Flexa payments. So this is why I, I always talk about this real world application. Why? Because even if the company doesn't like cryptocurrency as a movement, like Amazon there, we're considering it. We're considering accepting cryptocurrency. They still will have to, uh, in order to you, you know, accept crypto, they'll have to use flex of payments. And that gets AMP through the door. And that gets so many other ones through the door. So this AMP is Noah's Ark <laughs> for crypto, <laughs> literally. All right, if you want to survive, AMP is literally Noah's Ark. Okay, I should make a video for that. Like, like name AMP Noah's Ark, right? <laughs> okay, so uh, what you guys think? Like, let me know in the comments, man. Oh uh, yeah, I told you I was gonna show you some of my business, some of my actual businesses. All right, so that you know that I'm not just some YouTuber. I know actual business. That's why you guys were flooding the comments the other day. Like, David, you were right. You did say AMP, uh, crypto or Flexa was all about collaboration. Real world application was going to win. And that's when it shot up and all of that, blah, blah, blah. Don't wait till it shoot up to know that I know what I'm talking about. Do some actual research into these uh, these collaborations yourself and to these cryptocurrencies. Don't just be so quick to invest. It's okay to be second uh, uh, to the game. You know, you don't have to be the first investor, you know, all the time, you know, because sometimes you could be the first loser, right? And, and it's cool. It's cool to lose sometimes, you know, because you can win big with that risk. But it's, it's better to know what you're talking about. So we're talking with a... Uh, <clears throat> Uh, we'll do Las Vegas. David owns uh, many companies, guys. All right, so here's, if you know my cell phone number for my companies, you will see that this is mine right here. We're number one, the biggest bodyguard services in Las Vegas, and we're moving up the ranks in freaking Los Angeles as well. Not just that, uh, we are the number one internet company, high-speed internet company in Henderson, Nevada. We are the number one. Uh, and I'm just showing you guys this for, you know, credibility because a lot of you guys are like, oh man, who is this dude think he is, blah, blah. I'm the owner of successful businesses, the top businesses in certain cities. Okay, then we go to culinary school in St. Louis where I'm from. You see Alpha Job right there. 
the top university in the freaking in the freaking city. And it's the same thing in Las Vegas, okay, and in Fort Wayne, Indiana, and some of the cities that you guys know. And then we have other businesses like private jet charters, um, <laughs> freaking private yacht charters. So if you guys are looking to make quick money, you can go in the description of this video and you can joint venture and have 50% profit share of some real actual businesses. But as far as cryptocurrency goes, uh, this is a long-term thing because these are, look at them as startup companies. Go and re, uh, watch my video. I'll probably link to this one. Watch the video I just did about treating AMP like a startup company because these are startup companies. You got to give them some time. You can't sit here and base your investments off of this. It's fun to watch this, but you can't base your investments off of this. You got to get in on a real coin, something with Da, 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 real world application because the whole purpose for the invention of crypto in the first place was to replace <laughs> the US currency and government regulated currencies. So how can you do that without real world, real world application? Don't you use US dollar in the real world? That means your cryptocurrency that takes over has to be real world as well, okay? <laughs> These are, we so used to being on the internet that we think everything is a game. No, if you wanna replace the dollar, you gotta go, ooh, you gotta be faster than that. You gotta do better than that, okay? So look, if you're investing in the cryptocurrency, don't be turned on or turned off by this right here. It's cool, you know what I'm saying? But you can't predict what, what a company is actually worth off of this when it's doing things like this in the background. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? <laughs> when it's doing things like this in the background, okay? And trust me, like I said, I know business, all right? And if you want to know real business, go to the description, go to the joint venture page, and you can invest as little as 297 and you'll actually have 50% profit share of actual local business locations. And these are all high ticket, private jet rentals, private yacht rentals. These are the type of businesses I'm in, bodyguard contracts and stuff. You'll have 50% profit share of stuff like that while you hold on this. See, the reason why people are so, so bearish is because they're investing their last into these cryptocurrencies and losing it all. You're supposed to put, you know, your pocket change into cryptocurrency. It's a startup, it's a long-term investment. You're not supposed to put your last into that because it's a startup. A lot of these aren't going to be around. A lot of them aren't going to be around. Look, all right, like you supposed to expect your investments in a smart investment at least five to seven years in a real business. These are startup businesses. Some of these dudes still in their mama's basements. Okay, you got to remember that, man. So the only way to make a killing in this is to get in and hold, man. And, and go with the one that makes the most sense. And the ones that make the most sense, in my opinion, is real world application. I'm not going to get a tattoo, but you know what I'm saying? <laughs> it needs to be like, you know, pumped, man. Like it just does. Okay. So if you're new to the channel, do a Jet Li sidekick to the like button. Will it ever get to a dollar? In my honest opinion, yes, it's going to get to a dollar way before 2022, but that's only if the community pumps the token. AMP is doing it a lot right now, but you shouldn't let it do it by itself. If I want my investments to be secure, what do I do? I go and buy or own or build the company. I don't just sit and, and say one day I wanna be rich and sit there and hope that something jumps up for me. No, 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 no. You got to go and pump these coins, go to these local food markets, go to these local gyms, go to these stores, go to the dang on uh, a concert, go wherever you're going and say, look, you need to accept flex of payment. And I could bring a flood of people here. I could bring you a lot of business if you start accepting flex of payments. You can't tell me that these businesses won't say, hmm, well, well, what's flex of payment? You're going to be bringing me a lot of business. What's flex of payments? <laughs> They will, and that alone will just make it to infiltrate the dang old communities and weave into the very fabric of society. And then it will become real, real world application, mass adoption. That's what it needs, okay? So yes, it will reach a dollar eventually. Uh, if you're new to the channel, love you guys, and I will see you in the next one.